If you want to have the body, you got to do Pilates. Day 26 done, Pilates X. Never done any sort of Pilates workout before, ever. Day 25, and I'll get it right eventually. Uh, and that was interesting. I'm, uh, I was pleasantly surprised with my ability to handle some of the core moves, because finally, finally, the first day in recovery week, where I didn't spend the majority of the time in the plank position. It was normal abdripper type stuff where you're on your back and you're moving your legs around and you gotta control yourself, you know. Hold poses like this with your hands up and your chest up and your legs up and you can do that. <sighs> so I was pretty impressed with that. Then we got to some of the hip stuff where you're moving your hips around and sticking your leg up real high and bending it backwards and bouncing it and bringing it back. And that was a little rough. Didn't do as good there, but uh, not a bad workout. It was, it, it's, this, this is more, this workout's more on speed with what I expect from the recovery week. Kind of new stuff that you've never seen before that tends to make your body work in ways that you don't normally make it work. Just something to kind of help you loosen up. Kind of like, hey, yeah, you're big and strong and you can do pull ups and you can do squats all day, but can you know, can you open your hips? And can you move, control your leg when your hips are open? I can't. I'm not very good at it. Interesting take on the breathing, too. I thought that was kind of a fun to try. The way you inhale and exhale and how important it is to inhale and exhale while you're uh, doing your moves to help keep your core tight. You know, they said it protects your back, so I, mean, I don't think that Tony would lie to me about it, so hopefully that's true. But yeah, all in all, not a bad workout. This is a, you know, Fun little 30 minutes. I didn't really, didn't do nothing bother me at all. Kind of nice. I'm definitely starting, uh, I'm enjoying these 30 minute yoga, different approach to how you work out kind of exercises that I'm getting with P90X3. Wasn't really a fan of uh, core synergistics or the Yoga X and the original P90X. I didn't like those. I'd try to sub in other stuff on those days just to get my workouts in. But I'm liking this stuff. It's you know it's quick enough. You're working it, and again that that 30 minute time thing just lets me sit there and say, all right, this is uncomfortable, but let's keep going because it's got to work at all. And I think it's really benefited my flexibility, being able to stick in with the yoga the whole time or doing the stuff like dynamics instead of you know taking the day off. And I can credit that to all the workouts being 30 minutes long. I'm staying in there, so I mean. I can now easily touch my toes. I can, when I'm down and doing the hamstring stretch, I can grab the balls of my feet. Never been able to do that before. So I'm feeling my flexibility come along really, really well. And this Pilates does a good job at testing your flexibility and trying to give you some strength behind that. And you know, using muscles you normally don't use a whole lot of. So I'm really, I, I enjoyed that. That was a good little workout. Well, another day done. Getting closer to starting month two. I'm getting excited. Anyway. Let's check our day off. Pilates X, done. Ah, oh, tomorrow CVX. It's kind of disappointing. I was hoping for it was gonna be a new one, but whatever. CVX is a good little cardio workout. Maybe I can grab a, I don't know, do I wanna go weights? Or do I wanna stay light since it's recovery week? Well, I don't do CVX at all next month. Yeah, I might uh, go for the 10 pounds tomorrow. See how that goes. All right, hope everyone's doing good. See you guys tomorrow.